Hey, what is up everyone? This is Dynamin here. Welcome back to some more Pokemon Solar Light and Lunar Dark. In the last episode, we went here through the Mossy Forest. We got ourselves a few Pokemon. So let's go ahead and check out our team real quick and just see what we're rocking with. As you can see, we have an Alicritter right here. And we have Cheapip, which is the newest member of our squad. We also caught a Lavin Seed, but... I don't think I'm going to be using that right now. Uh, I'm going to switch Cheap Pip up front for now here, though. I don't know if we're going to have a city here right away. Is it going to be a new town or if it's just going to lead to a route? We'll see. You'd always take enough Pokeballs with you so that you don't always get the Pokemon you want. Exactly. That's why I bought so many earlier. This gateway it connects two areas. Many trainers rest in them. Okay. Well, we got Serpentine City here, which means uh, for Serpentine, 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 whatever. So it means that this is gonna be the next city. And I feel like we're gonna maybe have a gym battle here, but I'm not too sure about that. Hey, then you made it. Did you catch any cool Pokemon? Wait, don't tell me. I wanna see them in a battle. But first, I think we should check this place on my ride out. It's a trainer school. Do you think we might learn something cool if we go in? There's only one way to find out. Come on. Wait, hold on. Can I. Because I forgot to go to the Pokemon Center. Can I please heal before I battle you? That, that would be great. We talk with the teacher. Come on. I was got to go to the trainer school. Hello there, young trainers. My name is Donovan Bella, but you can call me Mr. Bella. I'm a teacher at this Pokemon trainer school. I teach beginners trainers things they will need to know to become the best trainer they can. I'm passing on my experience as the former gym leader of the city, which my granddaughter has now granddaughter has now taken over. Well, your granddaughter is the gym leader here. Yes, indeed. I taught her everything she needs to know about being a gym leader. She's still new to it all, but I think she's finding her feet. Awesome, Dynamo. This will be easy. I wouldn't be too confident about that, young one. She may be new to being a gym leader, but she's quite experienced in being a trainer. Definitely have an intense battle ahead of you. Hey, you know what? Let's make a deal, kiddo. If you beat her in a battle, then I'll and then show me your badge. I'll give you something special. I won't tell you what it is, but it's something very useful for trainers. That doesn't sound too hard. Come on, er, on, Mr. Bella. Come on, Dynamon. Let's go to the gym. Well, what did you want at the battle, though? What, what? Alright, whatever. What do you guys have to say? If the Pokemon holds a berry during battle, the berry can help them with the status condition or even heal them. You can cause Pokemon to have a status condition. Alright, I know that. Making an opponent fall asleep can help you get far in battle. If your Pokemon is paralyzed, it may not be able to attack. True, I hate paralysis. Oh god. Do you want to battle now? I'm gonna get to the gym right away. I want that gym badge. No, he's just gonna go to gym. Doesn't want to battle, I guess. Well, let me at least go ahead and heal up the Pokemon. And I kind of want to explore this town a little bit. See what the, it has to offer for us. So, I'm gonna heal up. I like the little symbol it places on that big screen right there. That's pretty cool. Why? Right, what do you have to say? If you and your Pokemon need a quick rest, just come to the Pokemon Center. The thing I love about Pokemon Centers is the fact that they cost nothing. Yeah, that's pretty good. Oh my gosh. Are they, all these guys here for requests and quests and stuff? Hello, my name is Password Pet. I have a very special gift in my back, but you can only get them if you tell me the correct password. Do you have a password for me? Um... I don't know what password you're seeking. No. Alright, so I have to get a password and then come back to this guy, apparently. I'm looking for a lavin seed. Wanna trade it with my monkey? She has a monkey. Hmm. I do have a lavin seed. You can have it. We'll see what this uh monkey is about. Oh interesting. Thank you. So what is oh, oh. Hold on, what is this thing about? It's level 4. It's a pure psychic type, and it's timid. I don't know if that's pretty good. What is... Wait, hold on, trick shot? Usually distracts the target, then shoots them with the small rocks or other pellets. It's a fairy type move. Very interesting. Um, I mean, it's a monkey, obviously with like moon symbols on it it looks pretty cool it's timid in nature I don't know if it's supposed to be 
a special attacker or a physical attacker, but from here it doesn't seem like the special attack is that bad, so... I feel like it's more gonna be a physical attacker, although the trick shot move is physical, which is unfortunate. Hello, I'm here because I lost my three kids. They are running through the city, but I can't find them anymore. Can you search for them? Sure I can. Well, thanks so much. I hope you can find them. I'm gonna talk to everyone anyway, so... Probably should be able to do this. Probably should be. Alright. So, do I need to buy anything? How many Pokemon do I have left? I still have 11. That's quite a bit still. Um, I might need some more potions later. I don't know. I have one antidote. Okay. I think we're good for now. Did we heal up a Pokemon? I think we did. Yeah, we did. Okay. I don't know if I want to train up this Monkey though. I'm not so sure. I mean, we already have three Pokemon right here. I think I'm just gonna leave Cheap Hip up front right now. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. This place smells incredible because of all the flowers around it. There are a, quite a bit of flowers around it. Damn. That's for sure. Serpentine City is in the middle of two forests. A long time ago, the forests were not separated by the city. After uh, the city was built, the environment changed, and this is the reason why the two forests look different. Very interesting. What did you say? My mom is searching for us? Oh, I should go to the Pokemon Center. Oh, well, that's one of them. That means we need two more, right? Well, I see one over there as well. Let's go in here first, though. Hello, I'm the Headbutt Man. They call me so because I give the Pokemon the possibility of using Headbutt on the special tree. Should I teach Headbutt to one of your Pokemon? Hell yes. I would love to learn Headbutt. Um, but who should I give it to? I mean, I am a jolly nature with Celepad, so... It's probably a decent idea to give it to Celepad. I could just get rid of the Pound, I guess. I mean, it is a 70 base power, but that's pretty strong. I'll give it to Celepad, why not? I think I can always get rid of it later. Oh, I can pretty much give it to ev everyone. Yeah, sure, why not? I mean, it's basically like a stronger attack or pound or whatever you have, so I might as well do that, right? Apparently, Cheap Hip can't learn it, though, unfortunately. I could also give it to the Monkey, but I'm not sure if I even want to use that thing. So, <laughs> I'm not sure. I'm not sure, dude. I just don't know. Alright, so that was the uh, trainer school. Sometimes City is a peaceful place. There is so much for me and my work needs to do. There's not much for me, he said. Stop hiding behind that building, man. What did you say? My mom is searching for us, so I should go to the Pokemon Center. Yes, you should. Stop playing hide and seek. Ooh, potion. Okay, we take those. Alright, more buildings to go to. What do you have to say? My husband says he feels like he is being drained out of energy running around after kids. Take this. Antidote. Nice. I don't hear any Pokemon that has been poisoned in battle. Everyone's kids are running away in the city, apparently. My kids make me tired from all their playing. Oh, I guess I was just playing. I'm actually running away. Gotta catch them all! I want to catch all the Pokemon in the world! Well, that's gonna be tough, because there's quite a few Pokemon. I mean, in this game alone, there is over 300. It's crazy, dude. Here's a hint. Thought I used Poison-type Pokemon, so a Psychic-type might be handy. Ooh. And we do have the Monkey. So maybe we should use the Monkey for now. Train that up a little bit. I only have a Fairy-type move for it, though. Very interesting. I want Donna to grow up. She's gonna be an amazing gym leader. What is this Pokemon? Okay. It just makes a sound. My Jumple. A Jumple. Okay. It's possibly the cutest thing that I ever did set my eyes upon. I love listening to it chirp in the moonlight. I can't ever take my attention away from it though, because I might just lose my Pokemon amongst all the plants and trees. So it looks like a tree, I guess. Who are you? 
gym leader Donna is such a beautiful girl. I couldn't beat her, but you know, boys don't beat girls, do they? <laughs> wow. Well, not me. Man, I'm gonna beat her in a gym battle, of course. I'm not gonna actually physically beat her up, but no. Oh gosh, no. What do you tell me? Oh, I should go back to the Pokemon Center. Oh, that's all of them, actually. It means I can actually go back to this lady and get a reward. If we even get a reward. Thank you so much for finding my kids. Take this as a sign of my gratitude. We get a protein. That's it? Just a protein? Wow. Alright. We'll take that, anyways. Alright, so here's the gym. Sorry, kid. Donna's not at the gym at the moment. She's taking a short break and is relaxing at Serpentine Gardens. You want to battle her? I suggest you look for her and let her know. Aw, oh, man, Diamond, she's not here. I guess she's at the Serpentine Gardens. We really wanted to battle, though. Oh, wait, that's right. I forgot that I wanted to see your new Pokemon, so why not the battle between us? Come on, let's go. All right, let's see what you got, Rodney. The first time I did lose to you because, uh... Apparently, my pounds weren't doing good enough. Alright. Cheap Hip. Against Butt Cheap. Oh my gosh, that's this thing is level 11? Well, hopefully this thing only has pack and Electrator can... Just take these packs. There we go. There we go. That's what I like to see. I'm scared to see what the level his ace is going to be, though. His Butt Cheap is already level 11. Ow. Alright, there we go. And it's gonna be the... The grass one, actually. Which Cheap Hip might be able to handle that. But I'm a low level with Cheap Hip. Probably should have grinded it up a little bit. Level 12. Pack is super effective, but still does like nothing. Oh, and it has rollout. Huh. Well, sorry, Cheap Hip, but uh, I want to get this thing as low as possible so that I can just use uh, Acid with Celtad and probably take it out. Hopefully. I mean, the hair over is pretty slow. Let's see. Acid. Oh, God, that is like nothing, dude. Oh, but that didn't kill me. All right, good. Come on, take it out. Yes, there we go. Just barely. Probably should have grinded up a little bit more, but we got through it. So that's fine. I enjoyed it. Got my revenge. Oh, I see that you're gonna win with ease. I have something for you which will help you in your gym battle. A mystic water. Oh, that will definitely help me. I'll heal up your Pokemon. That can definitely help my Celetad. I think I need to train some more before I battle the gym leader. If you can beat me, then she can surely beat me. Then I... What? Yeah, then she can surely beat me. Yeah. Nice battle, but it could have been better. Huh? What? Who are you? The name's Rick. I'm a trainer from Rassic City. Why not? We haven't gone to that yet, have we? I'm traveling through Rick Auto to collect badges. I'm gonna beat the Pokemon League. And defeat the elite foreign champion so that I can be the champion of this region. Oh, okay then. Wait, you're taking on the gyms? We're taking on the gyms too. Well, we would, but the gym leader isn't here. That's because I defeated her. So I guess she had to take a break. Oh, man. Anyway, I'm gonna head to Dolphin Forest. There might be strong Pokemon there. See you later, losers. Well, I guess he's like the douchebag of this game. <laughs> Wow, that guy's a bit full of himself. Anyway, then I'm, I'm gonna go do some more training before taking on Donna. I'll see you later. Later, alligator. Lady Gator. Alright, so we didn't go into this building yet. Got to catch Pokemon in buildings. I ride it once. <laughs> hey, have you heard of the Pokemon Dove Herd? I heard you can find them in the forest trees. Oh, so that's that's how you get those by headbutting the trees. All right. So we see this big place. Okay, nothing too useful. Okay, well at least we know that now. We know uh, how to get Dove Heart if we will want one. 
So I don't know if I should just try and grind up a little bit or just move on further for now. I definitely want to grind up cheap people a little bit more though. X speed, alright. This way leads to Dolphin Forest, it's quite amazing there. I don't know if we can even go to Dolphin Forest yet. I'm the only doctor in Septon City. If there are any sick Pokemon or people, I will cure them. I'm just not that easy to call because I missed by my opponent again. And again. <laughs> okay. Alright. Dying at his doctor. He can cure Pokemon and people. A multifunctional doctor. For Pokemon and people. I'm going to first have a gym match here, but my cheapest is grass type Pokemon. Which means it has a data advantage against poison types. That's true. Just like my cheapy. Ah, I guess I can go over here. I saw mysterious people in Dolphin Forest, but I was too afraid to follow them. I want to go into Dolphin Forest, but I forgot to bring enough potions and antidotes with me. Let's see what happens if we go here, actually. Oh, there's some spider webs in here. Which looks like to be cut down. Oh, yeah, we can't catch Pokemon here. I mean, we can hit this headbutt tree. Let's see if we get anything out of it. Oh, here we go. Ah, it's a dope heart. Let's catch it. Come on, pack it. And I really need a stronger move for cheap it though. This pack is just not that strong. I find it weird how they have a uh, the trainer battle team for from Diamond of Pearl as the Wild battle team though. This is kind of weird. All right, come on, get in this ball, please. I guess I could use Grass Whistle. Okay, well, never mind. We already caught it. Okay. It's said that the very presence of a single Dofert can calm even the tensest of situations. Both a male and female appear. Mortal enemies become lifelong allies. That's pretty handy. Will nickname? No. Nah, 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 nah. Alright. Well, I guess we can't really do much here yet until we have done the gym battle. So, hmm. I guess we can go here to Serpentine Gardens and just, uh, oh, I guess there's some trainers here. I guess we could do that real quick. We'll help us grind up a little bit. Level 8. Alright, this will be doable for cheap hit. For sure. Look at that. Two hit kit. There we go. Can we get a level up from this? We'll be great. Yeah. What's the Mega Drain? I mean, it is a stab move, so why not? Did want some better grass time or better move so that will definitely help can I find Pokemon in these flowers Got some silver powder oh we can what can we find here G pips all right this will help me grind up a little bit I can use it all right do want to heal up now, though. Oh, we still have the Dove Heart in our team. Probably not gonna use those, though. Okay, Lavin's Seed. I feel like uh, we can only get stuff here that we saw in the forest before as well. So I don't think I'm gonna use, be using Cheap it for the gym. Nothing here? I guess not. Um, I might want to grind up Celatot a little bit though, then. Or Elecritter, I guess. Eh. I'll just get a Celatot up for now. Are these gardens wonderful? I don't know if the evolution of Celatot becomes poison type right away, but. Like, it would be nice against the game, of course. I honestly feel like maybe just. Going with Salatad in the gym 
probably the best idea. Alright, Lavin Seed. Oh, I can just asset this thing. This is definitely gonna one shot you because four times super effective. Okay. Easy enough. We got an item. We got some different color flowers. I think they, they look different, at least. Some more butt cheeps. Alright. Alright. Stupid butt cheap put me to sleep. Took longer than it should have. Okay. Nothing here? No. Ah, you found an ultra ball for me. Thank you. Oh, the lavender seed. Well, I can just get rid of this thing in one hit. So I'll just do that for some easy experience. Got some more trainers though. My right, box won't be defeated. Let's see about that. I'll catch a pole with a stick it. Got some acid for you. Didn't even come on hit though. Sad. There we go. Give me a level up. Hell yeah. And here comes a jumble. We haven't seen this thing before. Ooh. It looks like just a bug type. Or maybe it's a grass type as well. This way is one way to find out. Oh no. Used bide. Okay, so it's not a grass type. Should be able to KO it with a double. There we go. Crit. That's what I'm talking about. An antidote. We'll take that. Ah, here's the gym leader, but we still have this trainer here. Might as well. Get this experience. I think once we're level 14, I might put up Alicrator up front for a bit. Alicrator could be useful against the gym. We'll see. Hamstar is coming in. Once again. So many Hamstars. What's up with your Hamstars, dude? Why do you have so many? Get some variety, dude. Alright, easy enough. Okay. Well, I don't think there's anything over here besides some wild Pokemon. Oh, what is that? I feel like that's going to be a Pokemon one of the, the gym leader is going to have. Alright, well, there's nothing really anymore here besides the gym leader that's over here, so might as well talk to her. Oh, hello, I'm Donna, and you are... Oh, you are Dynaman. Nice to meet you. I was just relaxing here in the gardens. It's so peaceful and beautiful here. It helps me unwind after a tough gym battle. This garden always reminds me of when I was a kid. I'd water the roses where here while my dad tr tried to find bug type Pokemon. Why did the music just stop? Oh, nowhere. That's weird. Oh, you're wanting to battle? Well, I guess that would be fun. I'll head back to the gym now and get prepared. So please come when you're ready. All right. Easy, easy. What happened to the music? Come on, man. <laughs> what is this? Music, please. Oh, God. Um. Okay, should still be recording. Um, That was weird. I have to restart my game, but at least it saved. So after it freezes, you, should, you just have to wait a little bit, looks like. Because it will automatically, like, save it and restart it. So, weird. Yeah, it was weird how just the uh, music just stopped and stuff like that, but... Hey, at least we got through it, I think. Oh my god, that that took kind of long as well. Alright, um... <laughs> but it's saved now, which is good. Um, and yeah, I, I, I don't know what to think about that. But we can do the gym now. Um, wow. I was about to be mad because I was like, do I have to play through all of that again? But, uh, no, thankfully not. What is this gym music? This gym music is insane, dude. 
I love it. Yeah, <laughs> champion Macon. Is it your first time in a gym? And then you have to know that you are only allowed to battle the gym leader with the same amount of Pokemon as the leader. Really? If you have more in your party, you have to choose them before. Okay, then. The leader of the gym, Donna, uses poison type Pokemon. Grass type and bug type attacks don't work well against poison types. So, be careful. She's using three Pokemon for her battles. So you can choose up the tree as well. The gym here is like a maze of rows, hedges, and trees. So be careful that you don't get poisoned on their thorns. But I'm sure you will find your way to Donna. Or maybe not. Haha. <laughs> maybe this will help you a bit there. Oh, an antidote. Thank you. Alright. Um, hmm. So we can bring three Pokemon. Well, it will be Eloquator and Celotat for sure. I, I, I could grind up Monkey and use Monkey as well. Because Cheap Hip is not really going to be useful, I don't think, in this gym. Um, hmm. I mean, I guess we could try and do some switch training, maybe. Get Monkey up a little bit. Why not? Let's try it. I mean, better have to have three good Pokemon against her than just not having anything. I mean, right now I only have a fairy type move though, so I can't really do anything to these things. I don't really feel like Elecrit is going to be that useful either, so I don't know if I want to use Elecrit. Oh, the Stotox seems to be like a rock type, a rock poison type. Interesting. Very interesting. Monkey learn confusion. All right, nice. Oh god, it's leveling up quite fast. I like that. I mean, this trade Pokemon, so obviously it's gonna level up faster. What do I? What am I thinking, dude? All right, there we go. We got Bubble Beam as well. This is gonna help. This is for sure gonna help. Thought it's my friend, she will beat you. Okay, so I'm up, probably grinding up Monkey a little bit. It's probably not gonna be that bad. Last final. A Tattard. Ta uh, fudge. It's kind of like a weird low tad looking thing. Oh, Leafage is in this game. Interesting. Oh my god, that was a crit. I just wanted to see how much confusion was gonna do, dude. See, that does half, so I could take this thing out. Oh, I guess that was a speed tie. All right. Well, we'll definitely take that. Ooh, look at that. We're definitely grinding up pretty fast this way. All right, well, I'm a trainer, though. Go, Spydox. You have a Spydox? What is a Spydox? It's a bug poison type, from the looks of it. Well, confusion, then. Ooh, one shot. Nice. Nice job, Monkey. Got that level 10. Alright, I have no idea what the levels of the gym leader are gonna be. Um. Yeah, I don't know if I should grind up or not. I'm gonna heal up for now. We do have a few antidotes. Um, so let's see, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? We got Monkey, Yellow Critter, and Celotad. Let's give Monkey one more level up. Let's grind up a little bit. Actually, probably better to, to grind up over here on this side. Okay, I actually forgot about this, be but because uh, Monkey is a traded Pokemon, um, since I have him uh, higher than 10 now, um, it's gonna s not obey me anymore. So. That kinda sucks. Hmm. Might have to do this without Monkey then. Ah, uh, I should have just kept it at level 10. Ooh, well, I mean, I'm gonna try anyways and just see what happens. Let me use a potion though before we do anything. But Salatad might have to come in clutch here. 
Oh, hey, Dynaman, I'm glad you came. Well, this is the gym. Well, my gym, I guess. This used to be... It belonged to my dad, so I just started growing my roses here. I've loved poison-type Pokemon since I was born. They can be tough, but beautiful, too. Just like how every rose has its thorns. Let's do our best, okay? Just have the three Pokemon for our battle. Alright. We'll enter Monkey, Helicritter, and Salopad. Alright, let's try this. Oh, man, I really should have kept Monkey at level 10. I didn't realize that was gonna happen, though. What is this gym team? This gym team is intense. It sounds... It sounds more like a... An evil team battle than a gym team. Okay, so it looks like Monkey is listening to me right now, so... I guess it's not that bad. And you have Spy Dogs. Ah, uh, CD turned away, so... Not really listening to me. Oh, that sucks. Alright. Um, hmm. I was afraid of that, but at least he got rid of one Pokemon. Right. Guess I'll have to trust Salatad here that he's gonna be able to do this. I mean, I am a pretty high level with Salatad, so... That could come in handy. Fever! Who the hell is Fever? What is this thing? It's only level 12, actually. I think we should be able to do this. This looks like a fairy poison type. I'm pretty sure it is. I'm just gonna use Bubble Beam. Ooh, a critical hit! That did a lot of damage. What? Warm Berry? Okay. I was like, what the hell is going on? What is that move? Oh, now it's using Potion. That's fine. I can still two-shot you, I think. It's barely, though. Yes! Easy claps! Look at that, we almost got level 15 for that as well. I need a bit more training. Even though we lost, that was a good battle. I've gotten a lot more to learn, it seems. I'm happy to give you this. We got a torn badge. Well, that's a pretty cool animation. Damn. You even got a nicely designed badge like that? I like it. TM102 Fever. It's a new TM, apparently. It's a poison type move. It has a chance of making a foe become burned with a fever. Thanks for the battle. Good luck on your journey. Uh, it must be a new status then. Fever. Can anyone learn fever? Our first TM. Nope. Nobody can. Alright. <laughs> Alright, so now Mungi should be able to listen to me more, right? Because we got a gym badge. Hey, Dynaman, how did your battle go? You won? Wow! That's a cool badge. I'll go battle Donna for my gym badge now, but you should head back over to the trainer school and see what is that Mr. Havella has for winning gym match. I'll catch you later. I'm assuming it's gonna be cut, the TM for cut. Let's check it out. Back to the trainer school we go. Hello. Aha, you're back, and what's that? The gym badge, congratulations. Now, as I said before, I will give you something that will help you with your journey. But seeing as you how you managed to get the gym badge so easily, I would like you to battle my students. It may help you, as well as them, become better trainers. After you defeat them, I'll give you that special item I promised. All right, all right, all right. Um, I didn't heal up yet, though, so I'm gonna have to do that real quick. I'll be right back. All right, let's switch up uh, cheap up front. I wanna level up cheap up a little bit, I guess. I mean, we do still have Monkey. I don't. I still undecided if I wanna keep him. Looks like a cool Pokemon, so I probably will keep him. If a Pokemon holds a berry during battle, the berry can help them with a the status condition or even heal them. I'll show you. All right, let's do it. Let's go get Su Susie with a butt cheap. Alright, Battle of the Birds. Oh, you are higher level than me, though, so you know what? I'm gonna go into the Critter. Oh, really? You know what? Screw you. I'm gonna use a full heal. Screw you and your stupid sing. Here we go, here we go. Give him a nice little Thunder Shock. Ooh, nice. 
Very good, very good. Oh, we got a crit down. I don't like that. Or I'm very shit. That's not good. That means it's not gonna KO you. No. Echoed voice. Oh my lord, that almost killed me. That almost KO'd me. It's okay though, we did it. We got through it. Here, give it to your Pokemon is buried to hold and will heal up in battle. That'll be pretty useful. Alright, uh, I speaking of healing, I do need to use a potion real quick though. I'm not gonna walk all the way back to Pokemon Center. I didn't mean to use two of them. That's kind of a waste. Oh well. Let's give uh, this Ornberry to Cheapip for now, I guess. Why not? Alright. Mega Bone Full of Sleep can help you get far in battle. It's easy, I'll show you. Oh no, you're gonna have another butt cheap with Sing? Please, no. Oh, Dove Hard. Probably also has Sing. Alright, leveling up my Cheapip. Gonna be more problematic than I thought. Okay, it's not using Sing, it's using Gust. Probably because it's super effective against my cheap ip, so yeah. Let's see. Oh, Dove Heart is pretty fast. I mean I have a plus speed nature. And I think Alicrit is pretty fast by himself, but Man, this thing's pretty fast. Can take my hits pretty well. Damn dude. Hmm. Potion up, I guess. Oh god, that's fairy wind. Uh, yeah, you know what? Mm. Just to play it safe, let's go into Celatan. Actually, close to leveling up Celatan. I keep accidentally pressing the Pokemon after I've switched out. Really should stop doing that. This Dovehard is really, a really fast Pokemon. What the heck? It probably doesn't evolve anymore, so it's probably already a fully evolved Pokemon. It's probably why it's so uh, annoying to deal with. Okay, we got some nice level ups from that. I think it gave quite a bit of experience. Take this Awakening. Could have used that against the other battle, but whatever. Alright, I, I have one potion. I'll use it on Salatad. I think it'll be better than using it on Elecritter. If your Pokemon is paralyzed, it may not be able to attack. I'll give you an example. No, don't paralyze my Pokemon, please. Elecrator. Ooh. Alright, uh, I have Mega Drain. Let's use Grass Whistle, actually. Put it to sleep. There we go. Yeah, take that. Mega Drain, let's see how much this does. Eh. Didn't do it that much, but... It's gonna do more than pack, obviously. Another Mega Drain, let's go. Oh, it's almost KO'd. Take Undershock, I can take that easily. And one Mega Drain, and goodbye. Should be a level up for Cheap It. Heck yeah, heck yeah, heck yeah, heck yeah. Here, take this. Your paralysis paralyze you. Yaha. I think we're gonna run with this team for now, like Elecrator, Monkey, Salatan, and Cheapip. I really like the designs of these Pokemon. It's pretty cool. You can cause a Pokemon to have a static condition. I'll show you. Alright, let's see what Monkey can do against this guy. But a Tidar. No, it's a poison type. That's perfect then. Wow, that was a good call out. Leaf darts? What is that? Oh, looks like Bullet Seed. Probably a special variant of Bullet Seed, I would assume. That's probably kind of cool. Alright, goodbye. See you later. Level 12 for Monkey. Yeah, Monkey's gonna level up really fast because it's a trade to Pokemon. Take this, Antidote. Definitely take that. Alright, nice. There you go, I beat all your trainers. Well, well, you've beaten all of my students. I promise here is your reward for beating them. We got Clippers. I guess that's the replacement for Cut. You know what this is? Let me explain. Not a long time ago, Pokemon trainers used so-called hidden machines to teach Pokemon special moves to interact with the environment. Many trainers used the one Pokemon as a 
so-called HM slave. So to prevent this, some special items were created to replace the hidden machines. One of them is the Klee's Clippers here. It allows you to cut down bushes and other stuff like you could with a could with a KHM cut. I don't need this one anymore. My daughter has one too. I hope these clippers will help you on your journey. Very nice. All right, that's a, that's a pretty cool like explanation of how hidden moves, you know, kind of went gone. That's pretty cool. I mean, obviously, this is not canon because it's not an official Pokemon game, but it, that it could, you know. Be a, the actual read the actual reason for you know hey HM's not existing anymore. Pretty interesting. So we got some clippers. I do believe that in the demo there were still HMs, and I think they removed that later. Then obviously because every Pokemon game did it. If they were to release a Pokemon game with HMs now, obviously it wouldn't be as good. All right, let's store away Doveheart. I don't I don't have the need for Doveheart. I don't need HM slaves apparently. Like they said, so we don't need to worry about that. Alright, so all of my Pokemon level 12, except for Celetado, which is level 15. I feel like I might have all but level 16, so I've, I'm like tempted to put up Celetado up front. But I need to give my other Pokemon a bit of more love, so... Yeah. There were some uh, cut tree bushes in the back here, so I will uh, look at those as well. But before we do that... That'll be actually in the next episode because we've been going for quite a long time. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. And uh, next time in this amazing fan-made Pokemon game, Total Pokemon Soul Light and Lunar Dark, we're going to be uh, moving on through the next forest and cut some things up. So thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys then.